Good evening and welcome to Und Marc Uth sind nicht mehr nach Manchester gereist. Vielleicht können Sie aus Ihrer Sicht die Beweggründe dann nochmal erläutern. Speziell bei Marc Uth gibt es ja dort das ein oder andere Problemchen, was, glaube ich, eine Trainings-, ein Teil einer Trainingseinheit eingeht. So muss man es formulieren. Ja, also grundsätzlich sind das Themen, die wir, die wir intern besprechen. Aber ansonsten gilt auch das, was ich vor Bremen. Ich uh, habe das vor dem Bremen-Game gesagt. We're not uh, pointing fingers at anybody, so it's not a decision against these two players, but it's a decision for the players that have travelled. Uh, they are all part of the group, and there's not much more to say. And I'm uh, just going to be optimistic and using the small chance, and uh, viewing the precarious position in the Bundesliga, uh, does. Uh, is this game perhaps not so important and you could rest a couple of players so you can have the full squad for for the game against Leipzig on Saturday how do you see it or have you taken that into consideration not not a second not for a second I have to say to you uh, I know the situation in the league that is precarious and very dangerous for us nevertheless We're going to try with all our effort and all we can tomorrow to, we showed in the first leg that we are capable of competing with, with City, 2-1 uh, uh, over 58, uh, and then we're in control of the ball, and then 2-2. Uh, two, two. We need to play better than we did in the first leg, and we want to take that chance, and it's not a question of resting anybody. From tomorrow night, uh, after the game, then we'll focus completely on the Bundesliga again. Uh, Mr. Tedesco, uh, Calduri is, is, is injured uh, right back. Alessandro Schöpf is also missing. Uh, what's your plan to replace them on the right flank? We put the question to ourselves over the past few days uh, there's no final decision as yet but like Jeffrey Bruma we could do it by playing him in a more uh, de defensive uh, approach although he's a left footer he can play in that fullback position even though he is a le left footer and we have two more attacking options Radi Matumbi Who, and he could also play. A question for Mathieu. How is it when you're playing against one of the best teams in Europe? Is there a difference on the pitch or how do you deal with it as a player? When you have to defend against players like Aguero, is there a big difference? It's, uh, it's a big uh, difference because uh, every player likes to play for games and uh, 
Also in the first game we, we showed that we can be competitive in the also big games like this to play against one of the biggest team in Europe at the moment. So for us doesn't matter and for me personally if we play uh, Champions League or if we play Bundesliga I don't see a big difference and uh, I hope so that uh, we can show it uh, tomorrow on the pitch and to reduce errors we made in the first leg so at the end we can, uh, we can see our chance. Max Siegmann und dann Thomas Herr Tedesco, Rutzke. ich habe zwei Fragen. Einmal, Sie hätten, glaube ich, nach dem Hinspiel gesagt, dass Ralf Herrmann das Rückspiel auch bekommt. Ist das weiterhin so? Und ähm, jetzt, Sie müssen ja theoretisch also 2-0, 3-1 und so weiter, um, um es weiterkommen zu schaffen. Kann man dann offensiv hier auftreten oder muss man es in der abwartenden Variante probieren, um nicht äh, ja, in, in, gerade in Stelle Gegenstöße der äh, Citizens zu laufen? Also ich verrate Ihnen ein Elftel der Startaufstellung. Äh, der Ralle wird spielen. Das hatte ich, ähm, Team Selection, the Ralph hatte ich, will play. Hatte ich bereits gesagt. I said that already, and I stand by my word. We have a great team, two, two keepers. Uh, it doesn't make it easy for us, but the decision we made, Ralph's earned it. And how we line up tomorrow, uh, so we'll leave that as a bit of a surprise. It's difficult when you concede. So we need to be careful. Mr. Tedesco, when you look at the first leg, uh, playing against City, it's easier to play than against Fortuna Dusseldorf. Is that the situation? They are two different games, two different approaches to the games. Uh, I don't think it is the that is the case. I don't, definitely not the case. It's difficult against any opponent in the Bundesliga in a position that we're in then it's, uh, then it's very difficult very strenuous but every game is difficult in its own way and for us every, every team I think every team will find it difficult to play against Manchester City well it may if it looks so um, straightforward then that's a compliment but it wasn't like that <laughs> Mr Tedesco another A uh, follow-up question to what you've just said. No decision against Harit and Oot, but four others. Do you mean that from a sporting perspective? Uh, that these, what Cedric Alters is for Oot, is ahead of Oot at the moment? In terms of sporting ability, that is, they asked me, what's what's the what's it about? It's about character, quality, and I, it's a question of character. For us, it, we've just decided for certain players and we haven't taken a decision against players. And, and, and that with Cedric, uh, it wouldn't be fair to talk about why he's in mind, why isn't. Uh, Cedric's earned it and training and I've passed Days and weeks, he's come on a, a long way. Mattia, how do you look back on your time as a City player? And do you feel you may have a point to prove here? Or you know, to continue longer? Are you disappointed the way your, your City yeah. career ended? For me, it was a great time here. I was here uh, two and a half years, and uh, of course, I was young, and uh, maybe I could do some things better, but uh, on all my time in uh, Manchester City I look uh, like a great uh, great part of uh, my life and my career and I was happy to be to be here and uh, of course now I'm happy that I'm back in Manchester and proud that I can play with, uh, with Schalke Champions League here. Uh, Matija, you obviously experienced playing here. How important is it that Manchester City at some point soon win the Champions League given all of the investment, all of the growth of the club that we've seen? Of course, they, they invest a lot last year and uh, everybody and also City fans expect that uh, they could win the Champions League uh, really soon. But uh, it's, not, uh, it's not that easy in football, uh, everything uh, must be perfect and in that uh, one season of Champions League you have to be on your uh, highest level and to be lucky in some, uh, some part and some games. So, It's not uh, that easy. They improved a lot, a lot since also I left the the club. 
and uh, I think so in uh, next years they can uh, they can win the, the Champions League could I ask one for Domenico as well um, I don't know if you might be able to answer this in English just because there's still a Manchester City fan in hospital in Germany obviously got attacked after the game I just wondered if you as a club maybe would wish him some support Yes, first of all, we are uh, yeah really really happy that um, I think he's on the on the right way. That uh, was was the information that we got uh, last week, and so we are we are happy first of first of all, and sure we are with him in uh, in our minds. Hi, um, just Rabbi Matondo. How is he settled? Um, and is he ready to start tomorrow? Yeah, you know, he also Deutscher. Is <laughs> natürlich ein ein sehr junger Spieler. He's a very young player. So young in the in the. Uh, and to play in the Champions at such a young age isn't isn't uh, doesn't happen very often. He's training well and he's working hard in training, but also he has a hardworking teammates. So it's it's not an easy decision, but we'll see what happens. Matthias, in terms of uh, conceding goals, last season the defence was last season was, uh, uh, let in 14 goals. Uh, tomorrow you can't afford to uh, let in any goals. What's going wrong in defence at the moment? What areas do you have to work on? We, we conceded uh, many goals last games, and uh, of course I'm not happy, and uh, the team is not happy, but. Uh, I think uh, it's not only because uh, because we show bad game and we, we play bad. Sometimes in football come uh, this uh, this time that uh, doesn't matter how you play, every shoot is goal. So we have to go out of this situation, of course. It's not easy when you concede every game uh, two three goals, but uh, I start from uh, myself and I want to improve and to see what's, what's uh, getting wrong at the moment. and. Uh, I, I, I'm really sure that we can go out of this situation and uh, tomorrow we have to be, what you say, on our best because uh, tomorrow is not allowed to, to, to make some uh, easy errors because uh, we came here to, to win the game and uh, we don't have uh, maybe so many chances because City has a good result from the first game but uh, of course we see our chance and uh, we have to reduce the errors. Philip Zeldorf. Herr Tedesco, ähm, Sebastian Rudi hat äh, in der Nationalmannschaft früher öfter äh, als rechter Verteidiger gespielt. Ähm, wäre das eine Option für uh, Germany, morgen? Ist das eine Option für morgen? Um, was ist uh, sein State of Play? How do you see him at the moment? I forgot to mention before. Yeah, I said there were two more attacking options. I mentioned Rabbe, and the other would have been Sebastian Rudi. Ja, es ist ein relativ Long-Term. He, play, he played in Mainz, and that was two weeks ago, so it's not that long ago. Mr. Desco, a personal question. Is this champion of the game as a break from the everyday? Are you happy to play in a different competition here in England, or is it doesn't matter to you? To you? Uh, yeah. Basically, I'd like it's, if, it, if it was if it didn't matter. Of course, uh, the situation is anything but unimportant. We're working hard on that, and here we're in the last 16, and we didn't do that badly in the, f the first leg. And here we are flying the German flag, and if we get the chance here, and then then we'll have to take it. Matthias, wo du schon mal hier sitzt. Matthias, you're sitting here. Uh, a quick question for you. You haven't played for for the internationals for a long time. Uh, uh, you haven't really spoken about it. What, what's your position with the national team? Have you finished with it, or do you think there's doors? At the moment, everything is the same as uh, one year ago. So I will not play for the national team for next time. It's not forever, but at the moment. Uh, I will not go there and uh, play for the national team.
Herr Bochner? Herr Tedesco, wenn Sie sagen, das ist mir nicht egal, diese Situation, das. How do you, how do you look at it? Wie ich verpacke? How do you deal with it? How do I deal with it? Also, wie gehen Sie damit um? Und how do you handle it? Halten Sie das vielleicht auch von sich fern? Wie how do you keep it away from you? Do you not get that in your daily mood, daily work? I try to focus what I can influence, and that's the team, the training sessions, the squad, the line-up. And I try to, the other thing is I try to ignore those, and that's where it should be. And the situation that we're not in, we're in the situation we're in, and we have to take that, face that challenge, and that's what I'm doing, and try to achieve the maximum possible performance. There were a number of dangerous situations from set pieces in the first leg, and the goal from Leroy Sane is obviously not to be forgotten. Is it possible to rule out unnecessary fouls and to avoid those situations? So not so not give away such simple goals. That's uh, incomparable with the pink elephants. Uh, and no free kicks, no corners. After 10 minutes, you know, six corners to zero down and 17 free kicks. Accordingly, we, we don't want to go to, of course, you're right. It's, it's difficult. It, it's, uh, you have to avoid giving teams like that can shoot the ball. And uh, that is a source of danger. But we try not to talk about specifically, but talk about clean challenges. Uh, question for Martin Nastasic. Do you feel this uh, insecurity on the pitch? Things aren't going right. And pass back rather than forward. How does it? How does it? This negative run feel? before it's sometimes in, uh, in football come uh, the time like that it's not uh, that uh, we didn't prepare the game good or that we didn't al analyze the opponent or that uh, in the worst case we don't want to uh, show it on the pitch and to play good but sometimes uh, it's not possible and it doesn't work on the pitch but uh, what we have to show always it's a good character and that we want to fight for this club and uh, this is the only thing and uh, I think also in our last game we showed that and uh, hope that uh, with this all the rest will, will come also. Gibt es weitere Fragen? Dann danken wir Ihnen hier bis hierhin gleich 18 Uhr das Training bei unserer Mannschaft hier vorne im Stadion. Die ersten 15 Minuten sind für die Medienvertreter öffentlich. Vielen Dank. Danke. Thank you. Thank you. Sure. Welcome.